one. Oh my god, it brushed up against my leg. I just got chills. Okay. Hey, Sean, can you help me? Is that the baby? into the unknown. We are on our own. We have our first campsite booked. Freaking out. I'm breaking out all at the same time. And uh, I'm really excited and it's gonna be awesome. sir hey man i was looking to see if keith was in today this is sean uh no that's all good man I'll, I'll let you go i'll just try him back a little later thanks though so this is probably our fourth parking lot or fourth walmart in maine really good service so that's why we keep coming here because we know that he'll have service for the day we have places at night that we can stay overnight because a lot of walmarts around here actually haven't allowed you to the fact that they have these huge parking lots that RVs can just congregate here. We've probably spent a thousand dollars at Walmart in the past three days. Love it's gonna you. Be beautiful. <laughs> I love you. Ready? I lose. I can't do it. The past few days, we have been working our way north through Maine. I love Cracker Barrel. It brings me back to my hockey days where you were uh, on the road a lot. You find Cracker Barrels all over the country, but a lot of the times, there's a lot of them in Boston and Massachusetts and that area where we played a lot. So I just remember mornings with my mom or my dad, stop, get a quick brekkie in, and then go to our game. So I like it. Ashley said, I will let you speak for it. What do you think about Cracker Barrel? I liked it. It was, you know, it's noisy. The one we stayed at was right next to a highway. I can't imagine all of them are like that, but. I don't drop your chip. Yeah, we've had a good go of it so far. I feel like Gosh. we've gotten lucky. We're finally getting into a little bit of a groove. I actually enjoy the the planning out of it. I know this is weird. It's kind of like a puzzle to jump between all the different apps and find the best spot and find the cheapest one and figure out like, are we gonna go here in the morning or the evening? I don't know, maybe that gets old. But for right now, it's kind of cool to be totally independent of everything and everyone. Check out this cute little keychain that we got from our Harvest host last night, which is basically a subscription that you can pay for annually. It's like $85. Then you can stay at a bunch of different breweries, farms, wineries, all around the country. So it's just an app that you pull up on your phone. So we actually stayed at one last night with our friends, basically Nomads, Bree and Devin. Typically, since you're staying for free on somebody's property, you are supposed to support the business. Just a gentle giant. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They have an alpaca farm 
farm that we parked on and they actually ship the alpaca hair out to a co-op in Massachusetts where they make these cute little goods and then they send them back and Red and his wife get to sell them. If you're over in Maine, you can go stay with a harvest host called Misty Acres Alpaca Farm. <laughs> what the fuck is happening? You know how when you like you shake someone's hand and you don't connect completely? Well, that's what I did. I came in as damage control. I came in after you and I, I had to be better for one of us. Yeah, Hope you guys like the Red Hot Chili Peppers. Oh, the, the oh my lord! <laughs> I thought he was like sitting. In, uh, Is he okay? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, that's funny. <laughs> 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 <laughs>